Today, we will embark on a journey through the cosmos, guided by the latest scientific discoveries and technological advancements. Have you ever gazed up at the night sky and wondered about the vast expanse of stars and gas that make up our galaxy? In this video, we'll explore the mysteries hidden within the luminous strip that stretches across clear summer nights, revealing the dynamic universe undergoing dramatic transformations. From the pioneering work of Carl Jansky in the 1930s to the recent observations made possible by state-of-the-art telescopes, we'll trace the evolution of our understanding of the supermassive black hole lurking at the heart of the Milky Way. Along the way, we'll encounter groundbreaking discoveries, ingenious techniques, and the collaborative efforts of astronomers from around the world. Join us on this journey of exploration and discovery as we unravel the mysteries of the cosmos and shed light on the secrets of the supermassive black hole that is at our galactic center. During clear summer nights, we've often gazed in wonder as a wide strip of light stretches across the sky. Now, we understand that this luminous expanse composed of gas and stars conceals a dynamic universe undergoing dramatic transformations. Astronomers are diligently studying a star that has surged at astonishing speeds. They believe it holds vital clues about a mysterious entity lurking deep within our galaxy. What revelations are they uncovering about the supermassive black hole at the heart of the Milky Way? From a distant vantage point, our Milky Way galaxy appears as a flat spiral, adorned with expansive arcs of gas, dust, and approximately 200 billion stars orbiting within. At its core, densely packed stars, along with thick dust and brilliant starlight, have obscured our view of the enigmatic inner regions of the galactic bulge. Nevertheless, evidence has been accumulating that something significant, something peculiar, resides there. The first to take note was physicist Carl Jansky in the 1930s. Tasked by his employer, Bell Telephone Labs, to investigate sources of static interference, Jansky stumbled upon what would become a groundbreaking discovery in radio astronomy. Using this cumbersome radio receiver, Jansky meticulously scanned the airwaves. He identified most of the static as originating from nearby and distant thunderstorms. However, there was one signal that puzzled him, a hiss of radio noise resembling steam. Jansky pinpointed its origin to a specific region in the sky the constellation of Sagittarius, towards the center of the galaxy, amidst a complex pattern of radio emissions. Jansky's discovery, dubbed Sagittarius A, captured public interest but didn't signify alien contact. In the 1960s, Eric Becklin, a young astronomer, delved into studying the galactic center, advancing our understanding during a transformative period in astronomy. He began his career amidst the unveiling of quasars, potent radio beacons in distant space that puzzled scientists. Becklin's initial focus was on Andromeda, using ultraviolet imagery to pinpoint its center. To locate the Milky Way's center, he developed a method to penetrate obscuring dust and gas using sensitive red light wavelengths. This led to the discovery of the rising brightness of infrared light, marking the center. Becklin's quest coincided with Reinhard Genzel's team's pursuit in Germany, both aiming to identify Sagittarius A, the source of radiation detected by Jansky. They found it to be a black hole, too small to observe directly, but revealed by orbiting stars. Tracking these stars' precise positions required the sensitivity of advanced telescopes like Keck. Their accuracy was remarkable, akin to discerning slight movements from vast distances. Meanwhile, astronomers used the Hubble Space Telescope to study MM87, an elliptical galaxy 50 million light years away. Observations of gas swirling at incredible speeds around its center suggested the presence of a supermassive black hole, 4 billion times the mass of our sun. This groundbreaking discovery, the first of its kind, hinted at the colossal black hole's existence at the center of our galaxy, although further evidence was needed for conclusive proof. The German and American teams aimed to gather conclusive evidence, leveraging Earth's proximity as part of a larger initiative to map the galaxy and decode its history. 
They focused on enhancing space telescope technology to observe the galactic center more effectively, documenting arcs of heated gas and detecting dense star concentrations. Chandra's data suggested around 20,000 black holes in the inner three light years of the galactic center. Despite challenges like atmospheric distortion, both teams used innovative methods to accurately measure star velocities and trajectories around the center. These stars reach staggering speeds, up to 10,000 kilometers per second at their closest approach, roughly 3% of the speed of light. Through these measurements, the teams narrowed down the black hole's position and estimated its gravitational pull, indicating a mass approximately 3 million times that of our sun. Despite these compelling findings, the data did not definitively rule out the possibility of a dense cluster of stars exerting mutual gravitational attraction at the center. The teams awaited an extraordinary event that could provide conclusive proof of the black hole's existence. In the early years of the 21st century, significant enhancements were implemented on large telescopes worldwide. Nowadays, most of these telescopes employ thin mirrors designed to be mounted on sturdy metal frameworks. Behind these mirrors, engineers install pistons and motors to delicately adjust the shape of the glass, compensating for temperature fluctuations and atmospheric disturbances that may distort the incoming light. In addition to these adaptive optic systems, lasers are utilized to project an artificial star onto the upper atmosphere. This helps counteract the turbulence that distorts the light from real stars. By subtracting the same degree of distortion from the light of actual stars, computers can bring them back into sharp focus. This advancement in clarity enabled research teams to make significant observations. In 2002, a German team operating from the Very Large Telescope Array at the Paranal Observatory in northern Chile witnessed a remarkable event involving a star known as S2. It made a sudden dramatic acceleration around the galactic center, reaching an astonishing speed of 18 million kilometers per hour. This observation provided crucial evidence indicating the presence of a supermassive black hole, now confirmed to be Sagittarius A. This discovery came at a pivotal moment in astronomy, when scientists were beginning to understand the active role played by supermassive black holes in galaxy evolution. These cosmic giants, found at the centers of most large galaxies, exert a profound influence on their surroundings. As matter spirals into a black hole, it heats up, emitting fierce winds and powerful jets. This process can regulate star formation and push gas out of the galaxy's central regions, influencing its growth. Researchers are now focused on understanding the activity of the Milky Way's own supermassive black hole. Is it still actively growing or has it entered a dormant phase? Just as Sagittarius A revealed its existence, further observations will unveil its true nature in the coming years. In 2001, scientists initiated observations using the newly launched Chandra X-ray Space Telescope. Directed toward Sagittarius A, the telescope serendipitously captured a black hole eruption. This prompted extended monitoring, revealing periodic flares believed to occur when matter accumulates near the event horizon, resulting in intermittent outbursts. These observations unveiled the dynamics of gas clouds spiraling inward, heating up before vanishing as they approached the black hole's core. Currently, astronomers are strategizing to study these flares more closely, aiming to directly observe the black hole itself. However, due to their immense distance, equivalent to the size of a grapefruit on the moon, traditional telescopes lack the necessary resolution. To overcome this, astronomers plan to synchronize observatories worldwide, effectively creating an Earth-sized radio telescope dubbed the Event Horizon Telescope. Expected observations depict a silhouette of a supermassive black hole, surrounded by eruptions caused by its rotation. This periodicity indicates the orbital motion of surrounding materials, with shorter periods suggesting faster rotations. Concurrently, efforts are underway to map the turbulent environment surrounding Sagittarius A, 
providing insights into its current state and potential future changes. Recent collaborations between the space observatories Hubble, Spitzer, and Chandra have produced detailed images of the galactic center. These images reveal structures like the Arches Cluster and the Pistol Star, shedding light on the intense gravitational forces at play. Despite the current dormancy of the black hole, ongoing studies hint at potential future activity with signs of impending flare-ups detected in the surrounding gas clouds. Moreover, observations from the Antarctic suggest the gradual formation of a massive gas ring around the galactic center poised to trigger significant celestial events upon reaching critical mass. Additionally, smaller clouds are observed near the black hole, offering valuable insights into its feeding mechanisms and evolutionary trajectory. Amidst these observations, astronomers continue to monitor celestial phenomena, ranging from large-scale structural changes to minute orbital motions. Notably, recent discoveries include stars orbiting the galactic center, offering prospects for unraveling mysteries surrounding the supermassive black hole's formation and its influence on the Milky Way galaxy. As these investigations progress, astronomers anticipate uncovering answers to fundamental questions about the origins and evolution of galaxies, including the potential for the Milky Way's central black hole to ignite cosmic phenomena on a grand scale. Our ongoing exploration of the supermassive black hole at the center of our Milky Way galaxy continues to yield fascinating discoveries. From Carl Jansky's initial observations to today's cutting-edge technology, we're unraveling the mysteries of Sagittarius A and its influence on galactic evolution. Stay tuned for more updates on our journey into the cosmos. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more space exploration content. See you next time.